Hello there guys, me Julius or Krokom33 and welcome back to another video where today I'm going to be showing you how to make YouTube videos on your iPhone. Um, so let's just get right into the video. Now, the first three things you're going to be needing, or the first thing, sorry. First thing you're going to be needing is a screen recorder, obviously. As you can see, I am recording. Um, oh, oops. As you can see, I'm recording here. There are three options I'm going to give you and uh, I will be leaving links in the description to every single way you can get these. Um, so the first one is Airshow here, which uh, you can record with, and Dr. Phone is another recorder. And then if you want, you can get iOS 11 and use the built-in iOS 11 um, screen recorder. Now, iOS 11 is in beta, um, and it's only a developer thing, but I will leave a YouTube video on how to get iOS 11 right now. Um, so yeah, that's the first thing you're going to need. The second thing you're going to need, if you're going to do it my way, is you're going to need iMovie. I know it costs money, but you should just, I think you should try to get it. It's worth it. It's definitely worth it. If you're going to make YouTube videos, you basically need iMovie. Um, so I'll cut to that next part. Okay, here comes the iMovie part of this video. Um, this is where you're going to be learning how to do all the iMovie things and a little um, part at the end that is just about how to download videos and add them to your videos through iMovie. So first thing you're going to do is click on the movie button up there and then it'll take you to this screen and then just press add a video and then it will take you right into this. Now this is a portrait video and as you can see it cuts out the bottom and top. I figured out a solution to this by just pressing the little button. So press on your video and then there's a little button in the top right corner right there. Click it and then after that just zoom out and then it'll take it to the normal size screen where it'll have black bars on the side. Um, so that's how you take it out. So. I'll show you how to put an overlay there, um, but first I'm going to show you some other things. So this is speed here, and you can change it so you can make it go faster or slower. So this is basically just like your voice can go higher or deeper. Um, yeah, I'll show you how to do the overlay in a little bit, but yeah, first I'm going to show you the main features here. Um, one thing I forgot to put in the screen recording is um, voiceovers. You can do that in a little bit. This is volume, so you can have it however loud. This is mainly for overlays. If you have two videos going at the same time and you want one video going louder, you can choose that. Um, and this is fonts. Um, you can like, so I would suggest doing a splitting. At one point, press the scissors and press split. And then go to the other side of wherever you want the font and press split again. And then go in that middle spot right there and then go to the fonts again. And go to your new font and then add your whatever title you want. So delete the thing and then add whatever you want. Font goes there. Um, yeah, and then it'll just have it for that little section there. And that's it for that. Um, so you can just have something going across the screen. Um, also, what you can do, so now I should be showing you the overlay part, so first thing, so now what you're going to need, actually, you can cut, um, you can split, uh, detach, duplicate, whatever you want to do, and these are filters, forgot, to, forgot about this part, but yeah, the, I don't really use filters, like, whatever, who cares, but, um, now I will be showing you how to do the overlay part, because that is, like, probably the coolest part, as you can see, I have an overlay on in this video, um, the overlay part is, um, you just gotta delete these things, these three that I have here, um, and then you add a photo in the background, um, so just go to photos, and then I'm gonna do my normal overlay, as you can see right here, and then what you do is grab it, you, like, you touch it, and then, um, what you do with that is you just, uh, spread it all across, um, yeah, you, you're first gonna want to disable Ken Burns, and then just zoom out, and then spread it as long as you can until it stops, and then click on it. Um, and then what you're gonna wanna do is just press duplicate, and just duplicate over and over until you have a long enough photo. For, the photo is supposed to be as long as your video, basically. Um, so that's it for that. And then after that, you go to your go to videos, and then go to your video that you wanna have over it. Um, so you click on it, and then press the three dots, and then go to the one in the corner. And then after that, it'll show up there, like kind of like a face cam. Then click on the video, then go to the little um, zoom in and out. And you can zoom really out, and it'll just cover the whole thing. And then press the pinch to zoom and pinch it out. Then press the photo, then press the video again. And then you have it, boom, an overlay, just like that. Um, and that's basically it for that. Um, for iMovie, I don't think there's anything else. Oh, if you want to have multiple overlays, just press save video here. 
and then go into your iMovie again, and then you'll have one with an overlay, and you can add another overlay for multiple overlays, so say you want to have a face cam and a video going at the same time. Um, but yeah, I think that's it for iMovie, basically. Uh, there's not really anything else I want to share about iMovie. Um, yeah, I think so. So now I'll be showing you how to download videos and add them into your videos through iMovie. So first thing you need to download is documents, and then click in the bottom right, there's a search bar. And then in the search bar, what you're going to want to search up is YouTube. So you're going to be getting your videos from YouTube, you're going to be downloading them from there. Um, so click on YouTube and then just go to any old video. It doesn't really, it doesn't matter which video you can download. You can download any video you want. Um, so yeah, just go to your search bar and search up whatever videos you want to do. Um, I'm going to just do my own channel. Ooh, 89 subscribers, a new subscriber. Hopefully, road to 100 subs. But, um, so yeah, just click on one, uh, whatever video you want to download. Then go to the YouTube at the top. And then go to right before the YouTube, um, thing. Um, I kind of fail here, but um, right before there, you press SS and then enter, and it'll take you to this. Um, an ad might pop up, it might not, it just sometimes happens. You can change the resolution, and yes, an ad does happen here. And you can change the resolution from 720p to anything or whatever this video is recorded in. You just press the download button with whatever um, resolution you want. You can also just download the audio, you can name it here, and then you press save. And then after that, you're basically good on that front. Um, and then it'll download it, and then you press and hold on it, go through back, and then go to photo albums, and then just drop it in there, and it'll go in your camera roll, and you can add it in iMovie by, like, splitting your iMovie, and then let's just putting it, pushing, putting plus, um, video, but that's gonna be it for this video, guys. I'll see you guys all next time. Thanks, and goodbye.